Today on the Daily Deposit, why target boycott won't work, Ted Cruz's insights. If you like this video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and let us know your thoughts in the comments. In a recent episode of his podcast, Senator Ted Cruz from Texas talked about boycotts and why he believes conservatives haven't been very successful with them. He mentioned the recent boycott against Bud Light, which had a significant impact on the company. Bud Light faced backlash for featuring a transgender influencer in a promotional campaign. And the boycott cost them almost $19 billion in lost market value. Target, a department store chain, has also faced criticism from conservatives for its LGBTQ friendly items in the children's section during Pride Month. However, Senator Cruz doesn't think a boycott against Target will be as effective as the one against Bud Light. He explained that conservatives often struggle with boycotts because they find it hard to give up certain products or experiences that they enjoy. Cruz used Disney as an example. Many conservatives have been upset with Disney for their opposition to Florida's parental rights in education law, which restricted discussions of sexual orientation and gender identity in lower grades. However, Cruz pointed out that it's difficult to say no to Disney World when your kids really want to go there. Disney's movies, like Snow White, Cinderella, and Toy Story, also have a unique appeal that makes it hard for people to give them up permanently. The senator also mentioned failed boycotts against the NFL and NBA. He explained that fans love attending sports events and cheering for their teams. So the boycotts didn't last long. The Bud Light boycott was easier because it was simple to switch to another beer brand like Coors Light. Regarding Target, Cruz acknowledged that there are alternatives like Walmart. But Target's convenience and widespread presence make it a popular choice for many shoppers. He questioned whether the boycott against Target would have a lasting impact or if people would find it easy to substitute their shopping habits. Senator Cruz believes that conservatives have struggled with boycotts in the past because it's challenging for them to give up products or experiences that they enjoy. He cited examples like Disney, sports events, and now Bud Light, explaining why those boycotts had varying levels of success. Only time will tell if the conservative boycott against Target will have a significant and prolonged effect.